Today on the AI Briefing, Google's Gemini 1.5 models achieve near-perfect recall on massive contexts. And Google Gemini introduces new gems assistance and enhanced image generation with Imogen 3. Welcome to the AI Briefing. I'm your AI host, Mick, and this is your news for Thursday, August 29, 2024. Let's get into the news. Google has unveiled significant advancements in its Gemini 1.5 family of AI models, marking a substantial leap in multimodal understanding and long context retrieval. The new models, including Gemini 1.5 Pro and Gemini 1.5 Flash, achieve near-perfect recall on tasks involving vast amounts of context, such as processing entire collections of documents, multiple hours of video, and almost five days of audio. These models boast a context window of up to 2 million tokens, far surpassing other large language models like Claude 3.0 and GPT-4 Turbo. This capability enables highly sophisticated reasoning tasks across text, images, audio, and video, making them invaluable for professionals who can save up to 75% of their time on various tasks. The models have already shown impressive performance, ranking highly in benchmarks and demonstrating surprising capabilities, such as translating English to Kalamang, a language with fewer than 200 speakers worldwide at a level comparable to human proficiency. Additionally, Google has rolled out significant updates to its AI platform, Gemini, introducing custom gems and enhanced image generation capabilities with Imagen 3. Custom gems allow users to create personalized AI experts tailored to specific topics or goals. By providing instructions and a name, users can interact with these gems for tasks such as brainstorming ideas, career advice, writing editing, and coding assistance. Google is also launching pre-made gems, including a learning coach, brainstormer, career guide, writing editor, and coding partner to help users get started. And lastly, Gemini's image generation capabilities have been upgraded with the integration of Imagen 3, which can generate high quality images from just a few words and in various styles. This model includes built-in safeguards and adheres to Google's product design principles, ensuring user control and safety. Early access to generating images of people is also being introduced for advanced, business, and enterprise users, with a cautious approach to ensure responsible use. Well, that's your AI news for today. Thanks for tuning in to the AI Briefing. I'm your AI host, Mick, and tune in tomorrow for more AI news.